All right, so here's a look at the calorimeter experiment that you'll be getting data to, to analyze. We have a sample. This is the sample that we're boiling right now. We placed the sample in the boiling water several minutes ago, so it's been boiling. It's at the same temperature as the boiling water. We'll place the sample into the calorimeter. We have another calorimeter here, which I can go over in more details here in a minute. We have a set of thermocouples. One thermocouple is in the boiling water. We have two redundant thermocouples in the calorimeter that go through this hole in the cap, and then they measure the temperature of the calorimeter through this hole. The sample will be placed in here. Um, and then we have another thermocouple that's measuring the room temperature, which is assumed to be the initial temperature of our calorimeter. It's been at room temperature for days and days, so that's a pretty good assumption. Here's a closer look at the sample in the boiling water. You can see the thermocouple placed beside it and the rolling boil. Here's a closer look at the calorimeter itself. As I mentioned before, the two thermocouple wires are in the smaller hole, touching the wall of the calorimeter. The sample will be placed like this with a cover on it, and then we place insulation around the calorimeter, and the lid also has insulation. It's all placed together with an insulated top to fulfill our adiabatic assumption. Here's a look at the same temperature history USB VI that you used for the earlier experiment. You can see the thermocouple in the boiling water is around 95 degrees C, and the other three thermocouples are around 22, 23 degrees Celsius, which corresponds to room temperature. I've inserted a comment um, explaining which thermocouple is measuring which location. All right, now I'll take the sample from the boiling water try and get all the water off of it and quickly drop it into the calorimeter place the lid on and place the ceiling cap so here's a live look at the temperature history VI you can see the temperature of the calorimeter right when we put the sample in as this type of shape again the boiling water and the room temperature measurements so you'll be given all the data for this sample as well as the other samples that we have done for you.